Thanks for checking out the part 27 highlights. This stream was pretty big. We actually hit the member goal during the stream. So our next Chow Garden stream will be four hours long. So quick shout out to all the members. Guy Kenzie, Fui, Kuda9000, 1v3 Running Man, Thanatos, Devin, William, Sam, Green Shy Guy, Mika Hotshot, Dawes, Viper Sniper, Zachariah, Batista, Citrus Loving, Cameron Simmons, Ruffy Rockrush, Tarami, Yonina, Lauren, and Zach. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, all of you guys. You guys have helped out the channel so much. You keep the uploads consistent and regular. It's only because of the channel members and the super chats that I'm able to upload as regularly as I am. So during this live stream, we had an evolution. We introduced a new chow, and we uh, did a little bit of research and kind of figured out how we we're going to actually tackle the hardest race in chow garden. So let's get right into it. But uh, here we go. So on the left, you can see an awesome picture done of Spirit by Elsie. So thank you so much, Elsie, for that. And the other two are both by Bone the Cat. The uh, top right there is Aura with a uh, cute, I think it's a Lu Lucario hat, looks very cute. And then uh, the other one is, uh, it had the caption, uh, Chow, when Fui, Zach, and Devin donate to the stream. So, very true there, Bone the Cat. Thank you to the uh, top super chatters, really helping out the channel. But uh, so we got Aura's run up to 25 there. For Aura, it doesn't really matter as much about optimizing it, just because uh, we're going to be resetting those stats anyways. Uh, to get them higher, but we got Nova here looking to breed, and all of our chow are stuck in the water, <laughs> almost all of them. We'll see if we can get anyone to uh, have interest here in Nova. Maybe Casper, maybe get to, uh, I don't think we'll get another invisible chow, but it's not impossible, I don't think. Oh, Casper's going! We got Casper and Nova, the invisible chow and our shiny uh, two-tone. Let's see what this looks like here. Oh, someone's playing the bell. Who is this? That? Oh, it's Rose over there. Our codes mods are actually like cheat codes within the vanilla and hack team. They're uh, cheat codes that are introduced by the mod loader primarily, although certain mods also have their own codes. But um, I guess it's more of like an extension of a mod. It's kind of like settings, I guess, within a mod. You have 726 hours, but around 250 on in-game. Other 500 is you idling while developing your tools. I think I've... I'm not sure how many hours I have. I've got it over, like, so many different save files. Like, this save file here, I'm pretty sure I'm already up to, like, 60 or 70 hours. I only started the save file in January just for this series. And then my GameCube file from my childhood, I'm pretty sure I'm, like, easily in the two or three hundreds. And my older game, or my uh, newer GameCube file from the old GameCube Chow Garden series definitely got like a few hundred on that file. So I don't know, i am got no idea roughly how uh, how many hours. I just know it's in the hundreds of hours for sure. It is a bland baby. Not uh, too spectacular looking. Uh, we will probably be editing the Chow, making it look cooler. But uh, here we go, nothing too special. Let's go quickly check out the stack grades. And we can give it a good old uh, name there, too. I think it's either a normal two-tone or a white two-tone. Yeah, we'll definitely be changing the colors. Even if it is two-tone white, I think I'll still probably uh, end up changing it here. I want to try and have some unique child spirit and aura. So we got an S in power. Uh, otherwise, kind of underwhelming, but uh, not terrible. Two C's and a D. Let's go over here a little bit more isolated. It's uh, I can't even tell what it's. What is going on? Almost... Oh, this is the... is this the watermelon chow you were talking about? <laughs> I was like, what is this? What am I seeing here? That's definitely like, it actually like moves around too. <laughs> oh my gosh! Make the color blue. I kind of like the watermelon chow. <laughs> Uh, let's see, blue. Oh, now it's kind of purpley looking. That's pretty cool. Let's try like deep dark blue. Oh, okay, that looks really cool. It's like alien, like watermelon. <laughs> oh my gosh. Do I have it update? I thought I had it up to date, but I must, I must not. Uh, Ice flared emeralds. I'm pretty sure it's up to date though. Changing colors looks even better. Let's see, what other colors can we try out? Uh, let's try white. Okay, white doesn't look anything special. 
think. Also, we got shiny enabled. Oh my gosh, without shiny, it's like literally just a watermelon. So let's shiny. Turn on the bright fix, although it didn't look like it updated right away. Let's see, maybe we have to exit the garden for that one. Hey, Vera Bear. Make that red one named Flames or Lab. It's actually uh, it's supposed to be a watermelon, but it does kind of look like Flames with the, uh, the red there. What about transparent? What do these look like? Oh my gosh. I'm pretty cool. What's it look like with two tone? I didn't even try that out. Maybe it will make it look uh, all weird. Oh yeah, so two tone it just. I mean, that's a pretty cool chow color. I don't know what color this is supposed to be. But, uh. It's kind of cool. It kind of looks like a mint chow a little bit. But we turn off the two tone. I don't know why the two-tone looks so much different there. It's a little weird. I like the name Sunburn. I think I'm gonna go with that one. So thank you, Lydia, for the uh, the name suggestion there. Elsie also said they liked it. There you go, Sunburn. So we got a nice uh, new and uh, very unique addition to our Chow Garden. Very cool. There will be more Chow content coming soon finished school a few weeks ago now, so you may have noticed the content's been uh, getting uploaded a little bit more regularly, but uh, there will be a slight slowdown here, uh, not this upcoming weekend, but the next weekend as I'm moving into my new place, so get to deal with all that fun stuff. But uh, hopefully the delay won't be too long. Also, we got Tide evolving here right in front of us. Wanted to come and hang out. It's half our uh, having a good time watching. Oh, we also got Cobalt here to, uh, to cheer them on. Got a Curlia, Roselia. It's a pretty cool team, Vera Bear. Thanks for sharing. Congrats on the new place. Thanks, Corey. I'm uh, pretty excited for it. Hopefully it's uh, a little bit better for streaming. Uh, hopefully it's quieter. This place is uh, sometimes a little loud. All of my neighbors have dogs, so I hope it doesn't uh, pick up on my mic too often, but every so often you guys are probably hearing a dog bark in the back. Okay, there we go, we got Tide. Up to a running chow. Looking good. What do we end up naming the new chow? The new chow's name is Sunburn. And we are going to make Cobalt into a uh, neutral fly chow. And we just had Tide Evolve. So let's go quickly check out the doctors real quick. But uh, I think probably off screen between this part and the next part. I will raise Tide's stamina a whole lot. I do it on stream but it's going to be pretty boring. But I think we'll, I think I'm gonna, how are we gonna do this? Like I'll probably raise the stamina a whole bunch up to level 99 and then upgrade it to a B and then do it again to raise it up to an A. And then Tide will be an all A child with an S in running, which is pretty good. I don't know if it'll be enough to beat the newer challenge race, uh, final race, but it will be pretty good. And then maybe at that point, we'll, I don't know, we could, we could force them to reincarnate and then upgrade another stat too. I'm not totally sure there. Okay. Thanks for all your tips, Olivia. It's cool having someone in the chat that's uh, beaten this here before. Thanks, Sylvie. Thanks for your, your cheerleading. Also, thank you, Fui, for the uh, $2 super chat. Really appreciate it. I don't know why the... Uh, stream overlay alerts a little bit delayed but thank you so much for helping support the channel okay we'll just give a go at this we'll try and attempt without like the good luck off the bat and see if we can do it, it took you 50 tries to beat it i've definitely tried like at least a dozen times now not as many times as you have but uh definitely tried a lot so let's see sorry i'll update or i guess while we're racing here i can update the layout for you if we Thank you so much for the $2 super chat there. We'll update your totals. The uh, top stream supporter, the MVP of the stream. Thank you, Fui. Let's see. All right, so Boo, third place, doing pretty good so far. Hoping we can uh, stick with it. Stay kind of right behind them. That was the advice that Chris gave us, not to really pass track run until the end. We're gonna stick with that. I trust Chris. I think Chris is the uh, 
the expert in chat here that will hopefully uh, propel us to a victory. Also, why are we looking at this chow? I forget how to change the chow camera. Uh, that was on the keyboard. Where even is Boo? There's Boo. Save stamina for Andon to spam to win Chakrin. The chow I used to win had good power and run. I think that's probably pretty similar to Boo. Boo's best stat is definitely power. At the end, you span the stamina with what you have left. Okay, so I remember someone saying right before flying, I think you said that, Olivia, too. Right before the flying section, you use some stamina, so I'll use it, like, right there. Hopefully that's good. I think you said also while swimming. Okay, so we're gonna have to start, like, spamming it, basically, here. If we want any chance of this. Come on, Boo! Oh my gosh, we're not even getting close to Chakrin! They're so fast! It's so stupid! Look how fast their legs are moving! Oh my god. So this is definitely one of our closest attempts though, so I think Boo is better at this than Snow is. So, Boo got a time of 226. Let's see, where's somewhere I can write that down? You need the short corners too? Yeah, it's, it's so ridiculous how, uh... How much is like out of your control here that you just need your child to take the tight corners and do this and do that. So 226 is Boo's time. I'm gonna try the race again now with Snow. So use stamina and intervals when your chow has the exclamation point on head. Don't press boost. When it starts becoming smaller than boost. Okay. Alright, thank you so much everyone for the tips. I got a whole bunch of experts in here in chat. I'm so mad I would lose races if they took the long corners. <laughs> Yep, yeah, so Snow's much more intelligent. You saw a boot or a. Oh, and oh my gosh, this might be the attempt! We might actually have this! Snow was super smart, way smarter than Boo. And we got lucky in that both Chakrin and the neutral Chaos Chow both got knocked down. We might have an actual shot here, guys. We can do this. If you raise up Tide, they might be more powerful than Boo. They reincarnate two times and have a lot of A's. Tide might be the best chance I'll see. You're probably right about that. But if we can win with Snow here... Oh my gosh, Chakrin! You are totally right about the rubber banding, Chris. They were so fast until he passed us and they slowed down again. And the short corner there from Snow! Don't say that, Sylvie. Don't, uh, don't jinx it here. You're supposed to be my, my top cheerleader here, Sylvie. Chakrin got wrecked. Chakrin did get wrecked, although they're still uh, barely ahead of us. Let's use a little bit of stamina. Yeah, Tide, Snow, and Boo are best bets. Sun one day might be able to also take it out. I'm not totally sure. Okay, good job, Snow. Got that right fruit. And we're close behind. Like, this is, uh, this is a close race. Be always next to him, check and boost him behind. Okay, I'll try and stay as close as I can. It's going to be a little bit hard for Snow. But, uh, we'll see, so, space out those boosts. Just gotta catch up to Chakrin. We gotta hopefully get some more short corners, too, from Snow. A little bit of luck there required. Okay. Come on, Snow. Okay, so now we're just gonna spam boost the rest of it with the proper spacing. Maybe not the whole rest of the race, but we'll try and do it as much as we can here. Oh, we're almost out of stamina. No, we still can't do it with Snow. It's close though. Snow had a slightly better time. Snow's time was 2.23, so Snow was three seconds faster. This isn't Boo, no, this is Snow. Boo is the other chow we had. Yeah, that's part of the reason I want to win this Ice Fairy Emeralds, it's so that we can build a Nomo Chow. So close, so 2.23, so Snow was about 2 seconds faster than Boo, but that was also with me doing the stamina proper on Snow, whereas Boo I was just kind of spamming it stupidly. So I'm not totally sure every hat this one adds, I'm not even 100% sure it'll show up in the debug menu here. Maybe they won't actually. Uh, accessory maybe? So yeah, press hat, that's a new mystery headset, is that? Yeah, so mystery headset, this is uh, 
Well, and it's uh, Meloetta's uh, headset there. Kind of cool. Pretty sure that's one of the new ones added by that mod I was just talking about, Darkie's hat. Uh, let's see. So Mr. Headset, we also got forehead gems. So here's a gold one. You can kind of see there's a whole bunch of like different colors here. I don't know if you guys can actually see them that well because the text is like really small even for me here. But uh, there's gold, silver, ruby, sapphire, emerald. They all look, I think, the same. It's just the color is different. So pretty cool. Forehead gem there. Let's see. I think there's some other ones too besides the forehead gems. Uh, red plumber's cap. You can get a Mario hat for your chow. Oh, it's kind of cute too. It looks really big. It kind of reminds me of like uh, baby Mario's hat. It's like way too big for their head. <laughs> so we got the Mario hat. Let's see what else we got. I oh, whoops, I'm in the wrong one. Accessory. Uh, so there's green plumber's hat. Uh, it looks like, yeah, we got Wario, Waluigi, Luigi. I like that Waluigi's in here too. Can't forget Waluigi. Smash forgot him. Gotta remember him in Chow at least. Uh, we also got Golden Crown. Okay, that's kind of cool. We got Peach's crown. Oops. Uh, let's see what else. I think I saw another crown. Did it say Flower Crown? Flower Crown? So... I guess it's Daisy's crown. I don't know what Sarasa Land is, but I'm pretty sure it's Daisy's crown. Shower will extend in enhanced shower to the big ones. Yeah, I like the mods that add uh, the accessories to the chow. I think uh, a lot of them are pretty cool. Yeah, so there's a whole bunch here, a whole bunch of different crowns. I think I'll probably at some point make a video going over all these separate ones, because honestly there's quite a lot here. Fox, Fox mask. Yeah, there's, there's a lot here, so I think at some point I'll maybe make a separate video going over each one of these if I ended up going over them all now. It would take quite a while, but definitely some interesting standouts. Chef hat. So, pretty cool mod, so thank you, uh, I think it's Dark Dark Benji or Darky Benji. Thank you for uh, creating this mod. And thank you Chris, who's been in here for the chat uh, for most of the stream for uh, creating the chat editor. Uh, do I have a mod list before I go? Uh, I just kind of read off most of the important ones there, Lily, but I think in the near future I'll probably make a video going over most of the mods I use, and uh, my plan uh, going forward is to do more content based around the mods and try and help uh, you guys set up mods too. I'm thinking about making a video on how to like actually download Chow World Extended and get that all set up, because I know some of you have been having trouble with that. But uh, thank you all for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the stream, please consider leaving a like. It uh, helps out the channel a lot. If you aren't subscribed and you watch the stream all the way up to this point, what are you doing? You should definitely subscribe because uh, you clearly are at least into Chow and uh, my channel is a Chow channel. So thank you to the uh, members also. Big shout out to all of them. Thank you, Lauren and Zach uh, for becoming members recently. Appreciate it so much, both of you. Thank you, Fui and Sonic Fan, for these super chats during the stream. You guys all help out the channel so much. It's only because of members and these super chats that I'm able to upload and stream regularly. So thank you so much to all of you guys. And uh, thank you to everyone who hung out in the stream chat uh, for the last two hours. It was uh, fun chatting with all of you guys and uh, raising chat with you. So I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you guys next time. The next stream should be sometime this weekend. There'll for sure be one on Sunday. But uh, I'm not sure if the four-hour uh, chow stream will be on Sunday or if it will be on a different day. I'll let you guys know, though. Uh, make sure to join the channel Discord if you haven't already. It's in the pinned message at the top. Any news regarding the streams will all be on that Discord, so it, uh, you make sure you don't miss anything at all.